einzigartig auf der Welt, das haben wir auch von unseren äh, internationalen Grundindizen nicht, dann sieht die Sache ganz anders aus. Das muss man wirklich trainieren. Das haben Aber auch notwendig. Das passiert nicht stürzen. Das passiert, wenn ich die Probleme habe, weil ich auch noch nicht weg So this facility is worldwide the best facility to prepare missions to the moon. We have everything that we need to test and prepare ourselves for the moon. It's a facility that not even NASA has or any other international partners. So we believe that in the future many people will come to Cologne before flying to the moon. Uh, I hope also all the NASA astronauts will train here before their mission to the moon. It took like more than 10 years when I first came up with the idea, I initiated it and said like we need to prepare for the moon because currently we're only flying to low Earth orbit to the International Space Station but the next missions will bring us to the moon and so you need to find support, you need to find the budget and you need to find the right place to build this facility and interestingly during Corona times we already had the budget but then it was taken away again because it was needed for other um, other duties. And then when we started or were ready to build, we figured out there are protected lizards in this area and these lizards um, you cannot just build where these are and so in the end we lost another two years and uh, we lost also the fight against the lizards. Um, the Luna is now standing opposite of the place where the lizards live. I'm convinced this place here will spark a lot of energy and creativity in European researchers, European companies, scientists, engineers, and this will, this will accelerate the way Europe like drives and flies to the moon. And we will be a much stronger partner in the international community with NASA, with all the technology and everything, the know-how that we develop in-house here. The unique feature of this facility here is that we have an integrated simulation of most aspects that we will encounter on the moon. It's the surface, it's the, the lunar dust, the rocks, the lighting, we will have a gravity offload system, we will work in spacesuits that limit our movement, limit our view. Uh, it's all coming together and that is special, it doesn't exist anywhere in the world, but it is uh, crucially important for before we go to the moon that we train in a situation that is as close as possible to the real thing. The moon is very special in that it's crucially important for our understanding of our own planet Earth, of ourselves, of where we come from. The moon is basically a twin of planet Earth. We don't know quite how it got into existence, possibly, probably by a big cosmic collision. And 
it contains a lot of rocks that are billions of years old that are similar to the ones on Earth, which we don't find on Earth anymore. We cannot study them here. If we go to the moon, we can study, we can read in like a history book. Now and you can see the stars and stripes on the lunar surface. 